today we're gonna be watching my third collab with Darman, and I have not seen it yet, so we're gonna be watching it for the first time together. Uh, I'm so sorry, Bree. Are you trying to be funny, Jordan? Let me give y'all some backstory. Jordan, the bully from the last episode, is now the school janitor. Oh, how the tables have turned. No, I, I didn't mean to do that. I was just trying to throw it in the trash. Really? All right then, let me help you throw it in the trash. <laughs> Since you are trash, Jordan. Nice one. Oh no! When the bully learns his lesson and becomes a good guy, and then he himself gets bullied by an even greater bully. When are we gonna get to the final boss of bullies? You don't have to be so mean. You know, it must be so embarrassing having to clean floors between classes because your mom is so poor. <laughs> hey, don't talk about my mom. And besides, you shouldn't judge someone until you walk in their shoes. I'll talk about whoever I want to talk about. Jordan the janitor. <laughs> <laughs> that was so funny, Ashley. Good one. Because he's a janitor. You know, I could call you Bree the bitch. But then she would tell me not to be so mean. Jordan the janitor. That's so good. And besides, why would I want to walk in your nasty shoes? He smells. <laughs> Bree the bench made a funny. <laughs> what is this crumpled paper? Sniper wolf. <gasps> She's gonna be at her school today? Yeah. You didn't know? I She's am? coming after school with Psycho Mantis. I am? Says who? Darman did not pay me enough donuts for this. <laughs> when I saw this, like, honestly, I didn't even know what we were doing. And then I showed up, I saw this on the wall, I'm like, wait, we doing a meet and greet, huh? Yo! I heard Sniper Wolf just got here. Let's go outside and look. <laughs> Why does this like trigger my anxiety? Like, because in real life I'm just like, mm, hat on, mind my own business, avoid confrontation at all costs. Oh, that's me. <laughs> that was a close one. Thanks again for doing this meet and greet. Sorry, I didn't think it'd get this crazy. Bro, what meet and greet? I'm literally hiding behind the counter. This ain't a meet and greet, there's a hide and seek. Oh, it's totally fine. Wait. Isn't that Jordan? What are you doing just as a janitor? I picked up a job to help my mom with rent. I know it's so embarrassing. No, it's not. It's actually really cool. Yeah, like I used to work at a store folding clothes. There's no shame in hard work. <laughs> it wasn't hard work. <laughs> Tedious. I was folding clothes, bro. I would like stand at the front of the store and greet people and like fold clothes and the hardest part about my job was folding the polos. You have to fold using a board. But for real though, there is no shame in getting a job to help your parents. In fact, you should be proud. I wish that was true. There's this girl, Bree. She just humiliated me in front of all the school. You're joking. Yeah, he is joking because it was actually like five people. Bree? Someone should call her parents. Oh no, I think they're coming. This way before they see you. Quick, run it's from the fans! <laughs> Bro, we did that take like 50 times. You see that whole part right there? It took several hours to shoot that. Cause like, I look at this and I'm like, yeah, it took me like 10 minutes to do this. No, this took like two days. I ran through that door at least 17 times. Hey, um, have you seen Sam or Snipe Wolf? No, I haven't. Oh. oh, whoops. Girl, I would not have done that when that dude is holding a broom. He could literally like just boosh. Very dangerous. I missed. <laughs> Can you leave me alone? I'm just trying to get my work done. I mean, you're trying to get your work done. I would just sweep him on out of the cafeteria. Like, go on, get out of here. Trash. Oh, he's just trying to get his work done. Now I feel bad. Here, I'll help you. Wow, thanks, Bree. I clean this, Jordan the janitor. 
Ouch. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> oh, that was so good. He really thought she was gonna help him clean. No, but I'm gonna help you make a mess. All I'm saying is, if this was real life, she gonna get a mouthful of bristles. How would you do that? <laughs> What's the big deal? It's your job to clean, isn't it? How would you feel if I did that to you? <laughs> I wouldn't know. My mom's rich, so I'll never have to work a day in my life. I'm like, your mom? <laughs> have fun cleaning this up, loser. What a flex, my mom is rich. I never have to work. I'm gonna grow up to be an influencer. Hey, Jordan. Come quick. Again? Toilet's clogged. Bro, three times in one day? You know, Brie, for somebody who's so rich, it seems like you have a part-time job tormenting the janitor. That's kind of low, bro. Oh, I'm actually off the clock. Aw. All right, I'll tell you what. You make like six bucks an hour? Here's 50 cents for some of your time. Now go clean the toilet, Jordan the janitor. <laughs> Six bucks? Who makes six bucks? I'm big ball with twelve dollars an hour. What you talking about? You know what, Bree? I used to be a bully too. <laughs> you see? <gasps> Look, there's Sniper Wolf. <laughs> <laughs> I looked too. I was like, where? <laughs> ah, I'm not supposed to be laughing with her. That's the bully. But that was funny. You better clean this up. <laughs> Bree Elizabeth Johnson. Oh, mother is here. Mom, what are you doing here? I heard how you've been treating Jordan. How could you act like that? What heard from who? We're Snape Wolf. Hey friends, let's go outside so we can hang out. Come on. Uh, <laughs> snitch! Darn it, y'all may be the snitch. <laughs> you know what? I have Bree's mother on speed dial. Hello, yes, Bree's mother. Bree is being a little binge. Come collect your child. And then quick, I came in for the distraction. Hey friends, let's go outside so we can hang out. Come on. Hi, hey friends, wait, that's me. not right. Hello friends, it's oh, me. Oh, you can go too, honey. Sorry. <laughs> Everybody gets to meet Sniper Wolf except you! <laughs> she spilled all this water on the floor. What? Quiet. What's the big deal? He's just a janitor. How would you like it if somebody treated you that way? You should Bye. never judge someone until you have walked in their shoes. <laughs> You're joking, right? She really laughed. I would have just smacked her right then and there. Like, what have I raised? We have money. Okay, I would never be a janitor. That's gross. There is no shame in hard work. Yeah, even I said that. You know what? That's the problem. You have never done hard work a day in your life. That's gonna change. What do you mean, bro? I literally go to school. That's the hardest work. And then I even picked up a part-time job bullying the janitor. What are you talking about? You, my dear, are going to be a janitor. Oh. So you know how it feels. And you can start by cleaning up this mess you made. What? No, mom, there's no way I'm gonna do that. You don't have a choice. It's either that, or you are grounded the entire summer. <laughs> Come on, Jordan. Let's go hang out with Sniper Wolf. <laughs> oh, this is so dumb. You mean I have to clean the floor and I'm not gonna get to meet Sniper Wolf? Worst summer ever! Bree can't believe what Mwah. just happened. Mwah. The next day, Bree has to clean the floors in between classes. Aww. One of the students comes and throws their garbage at her, laughing and calling her names. Oh, her, her. She's gonna be the final boss in the next one. Bree is so embarrassed. And during lunch, while Bree is picking up the trash, another student dumps the entire <gasps> garbage can on the floor. All the kids laugh and stare. Bree gets completely humiliated. And after school, while Bree is mopping the floor, one of her classmates comes and dumps the entire bucket of water for her to clean up. It's almost like they 
were watching her and they were like, okay, you know what? Well, would you look at the time? It's bully Bree o'clock. The whole school can't stop laughing. I mean, I feel like if they're laughing at that, like all of you guys are part of the problem. Nobody gonna say nothing. Bree's so embarrassed and finally understands what she made Jordan feel like. Okay, now apologize and the bullying and will And then stop. one day, Bree happens to run into Jordan. What, did she take his job? Here you go. 186. I know it's not much, but I hope it helps. Oh, honey, I am so proud of you. This is gonna help more than you'll ever know. Mom, can you give me a cook sec? I'll be right back. Okay. Hey, Bree the bottle collector. I'll help you. Please don't hit me with that. Hit you with it? Why would I do that? I don't know, because of how I treated you. Look, I just wanted to say that I'm sorry. I never should have judged you before walking in your shoes. Never knew how hurtful it was to be made fun of. Can you please forgive me? Of course. Come on. Aww. I'll help you finish. <laughs> brutal to her like I know she was the only one picking on Jordan but the whole school was picking on her like she learned her lesson and some but yeah that was good and all the actors I worked with phenomenal and they're all really nice people in real life big thanks to their man for letting me be a part of this but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to hit that like button in the face and make sure you turn on notifications click click and make sure you subscribe to the wolf pack and check out Darman's channel in the description below. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.